Might as well. I honestly have no idea where I'm even going to start once I get in. What I'm even going to do. First thing, no idea. Um, the only thing I really did do was create my character on the day that it dropped. And I played about 10-15 minutes just to see how it felt. And then I stopped. So. I really didn't get far into it at all. Um, I know some people from Rebel will be playing tonight. So hopefully we can meet up with some of those guys. Uh, also, it looks like my friend Bond guy might be playing right now too, which would be cool. Uh, let me check and see. Okay. Got this. And all right, there we go. I got good old uh, the Red Dead Redemption channel opened up. So, um, do I should I just go into collector mode or should I do one of these other ones? I'm not sure. I guess we'll try uh. We'll just try straight up clicking collector mode. See what it does. I haven't done or used any of these. I haven't done any of the classes yet either. I have not even tried anything yet for um, the since the Frontier update for Red Dead Redemption 2. So everything that goes down is all brand, brand new for me. We'll see how it goes, though. We shall see. I feel like the game's pretty quiet right now. Bump it up to like 80. Ugh, I need to clean this up. It's like junk. Sitting here, that totally does not the beast. Need to be sitting on my table. Alright, so we're loaded in. Crips has packed up your camp. Use the player map to set it up again. So, Madam is down here today, I believe. What is that? Oh, to become a collector. Oh, wait, does it actually select it? It does. I think it's because I'm doing this for the first time, though. Okay. Uh, do we have a fast travel point? Awesome, we do. There's literally one right here. Do I, how much money do I have? The it's one thing I don't know. Twenty dollars. <laughs> Great. What's the closest area to it? Tumbleweed. Looks like it. Benedict Point, if I can get down there. Tumbleweed is six dollars. Is there like a Benedict Point at all? Blackwater. Um, let me check one more time. I like the mouse lags. That's weird. Plainview, Port Mercer. I think tumblebe Tumbleweed might be the closest location. Oh, that's always good too. Getting connected, first thing. It's a great feeling. Keep an eye on my bit rate. Hopefully, we'll just get into a new game here. <laughs> nice thing is I can pull up all the information on the left, too. Here's the uh, pinned messages. Okay. 
Render mission. Okay. I think this is the. Red Dead Redemption 2 map. Does this work for Madame Lazar? Trying to start with the collector stuff. I'm literally level like two. I think at four. <laughs> so I'm not even far at all in this. The thing that sucks is I, I, I don't have any of the uh, gold bars that I bought or had. Um, oh, wait, no. I do have, like, 50. So maybe it does sync up? Um, don't remember it, but... Or maybe it's because I got the gold edition, too. Or, I mean, the ultimate edition. So that might be helping me. Um... Where exactly am I going? I don't really know. So, if I click on that. Point of interest. Oh god. Somebody keeps falling. You good, fella? It is so dark out here. died stranger who did that it is extremely foggy right now he is to get on do we have a um, there's stable out here yeah there is okay because I forgot there's actually a uh, some sort of saddle I can get for free Oh wait, other way. Jeez. Frame rate is literally so smooth. So smooth. 50 gold bars were for pre ordering any edition, I think. Oh yo, what's, what's up, Jan? Gotcha though. All right, so at least I have that, um, and I can use that on getting the collector's bag, right? And then the sh could I should I use it on the shovel, or can you use it on the shovel and like other thing, or worth holding on, holding off? Ah! I trying to get control of the horse. I don't know if I'm doing something wrong, but it feels so weird. Like, should I aim? with my mouse because it looks like wherever your mouse is going that's where your horse goes but at the same time i don't do you know the link for the uh the madam uh madam lazar's gear Uh, you can use it. You can use it on the shovel and the metal detector, I think, but you still need to level collector to five for the metal detector. Okay, got it. Um, manage owned horses, roach. I think it's appearance. I don't want to change anything that costs money yet. Saddles. Add saddle. It's not. Let me click. This was a, a glitch on the same, the day I first started to, here we are. All right, where's the free ones? Nope. 
I think it's the special saddles. Here it is, high plains. Nice saddle bags, standard. Oh my god, am I supposed to? All right, yeah, let's do up and down arrow. Can't change the color of it, unfortunately. Do upgraded saddle bags give you anything better? Collector saddle bag. Bed rolls, lanterns. Mask. You get a mask for your horse. That's pretty cool how the saddles affects the stats. Seven or twelve percent less uh, core drain, core drain rate. Oh, for both uh, them and then regenerate. Nice. Plus 12. Coo coo. Uh, I don't know if I should spend any of my money because I'm practically broke still. Yeah, they give more outfit and hat slots on your horse. Really? Huh. That's cool. That's funny too. You know, for being level 4, I feel like I'm already satisfied. Um, there are some free guns I get to uh, keep pressing N. Can you open up the the book while on your horse? Upgraded one gives you five outfit and has hat slots, and the collector saddle bags give you seven outfits and hat slots. Really, jeez. Um. How do I open up the... Is it L? No. L is player lobby. Things like that. Posse. What? Oh, is that just showing posses in the game? Camp. Set up camp location. Small camp. This is not free. Well, that's unfortunate. If it's in the bottom left, where should I put it? Rio Bravo, maybe? Is that right here? Yeah, it is. Okay. Yeah, let's move camp to Rio Bravo. Camp is pitched. Stables. There it is. Hey, thank you. Thank you, Jim. Okay. Ah, there it is. Thank you. Thank you very much, sir. Got the Redemption 2 collector map. Let's go ahead and put that under MMO, even though it's not an MMO. Let's go back to this. And... Hey, that's the map you want unless you wanted to find collectibles yourself without a map. Nope, that's the map I'm looking for. I'm not trying to spend all that time trying to find them myself. <laughs> the smart route would be to... If, if there's a, a way to do it, I'll take that. Okay, settings, uh, controls, mouse and keyboard. How do you open up the, uh, the book? Because I know there's some free guns I never redeemed last time. Sell, buy, equip, blah, 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 extra option, zoom, tab, open satchel, open journal. I know it's got to be here somewhere, right? Photo mode is F6. How do you open up the book? Oh no. Interact with horse. See all that. Did I? Buy from the shop, E. H is horse. Abandoned radar, open. Satchel, open journal, item wheel. I feel like it should be in here, right? But it's not. 
the book with the collector's thing. I know it's like on the D-pad, it's something. Oh my gosh, he's gonna kill me. Uh, G, H, J, catalog, J, oh my gosh. There it is, weapons, unique weapons. All right, let's go through these. Owned volcanic pistol. Thank you. I think I can get two of them. Is the uh, the dual hoster worth buying? I know I did that last time. I know it's a level 25 unlock, but you can get it like right away if you spend that money on it. Where is it? It's like the the side holster, gun holster or something. Oh wait, no, I think it's actually one of these. Is it one of these? Does it tell you what they do? Uh, view. Read. Rope gun belt. Here it is. Ah, gunslinger holster. Offhand holster with machine and buckles. Okay. Yeah, there it is. Well, that's the level 25 one. For your offhand stuff. I might do it. But I'm gonna wait on some advisory. Only if you want to deal wield or dual wield, really. Um, I might. Just because I kind of do want to have at least one holster. Should I just get the highest one that you can buy for gold? Or the best one? Are these literally all cosmetic? Because I could get this embroidered one. Gunslinger holster. I think I'm gonna take this embroidered one. It's level 86. <laughs> oh wait. Wait, I have to be that level to unlock it? Anyways? They're all the same, you just cosmetic? Okay. Wait. Am I locked to level 26 in order to even buy it? I thought you could buy some stuff with gold, even if you weren't the level. You. Oh, rank gold. Wait, what? Oh, if you're level 86. Boy. <laughs> it tells you how much it'll cost. It'll say 10 gold. Or I can buy this one for 4 gold. That's weird. Why does it say 1? This one is three gold. It's probably like 12 then. This one's 34. I guess I'll just take this standard gun holster then. Bye now. Owned. Now I should be able to go all the way back to weapons, unique weapons. And there should be that pistol. I can buy a second one. Yep, there we are. I wanted two volcanic pistols, of course. Okay. Oh wait, do we have a bow, actually? Really? A uh, rank 10. That's not too bad. Provisions, tonics, hunting, and fishing. Cocaine gum. 
fishing rod is level 14. Workwear and trades, collector. The Wentworth. These are just outfits. Do they actually do anything though? Read. They're just outfits, right? They don't like give you any stat boosts or anything. Special horse. Rank one. Okay, I think we're good. I don't really need anything. Hop on the horse. And make our way down to whatever her name is for the first time. Oh. I feel like I can't control this thing for the life of me. Why is it so much more difficult? Okay. Stay on the path. Should be good now. Damn, dude. What a beautiful game. Quite a change from uh, playing Need for Speed to this. It runs so smooth, too. Jeez. I don't even want to do a comparison of this and uh, console version. at him go. So proud. All right, man. The only thing that would make this game better, I think, is if it was cross-platform or if you could transfer your characters. Both of those combined would be amazing. Get him go. The details, man. Like, I feel like I'm watching a cinematic right now. Not even, like, playing a video game. Almost there. I forget, does, it, does the horse stop when we get there, or do I have to stop it? I don't remember. There she is. Heard many things about you, ma'am. Hello, stranger. Whoa. You don't got the eye. Just an eye for a deal. I told you, go away, old man. Nothing but false prophecies and fake jewelry. Go away, or I see much pain and suffering in your future. <laughs> <laughs> a crook and a charlatan. Uh, Make sure you know what you're getting into with this one. Hey, please, don't listen to him. I am Madame Nassar, channeler of spirits, finder of lost things, and since everyone seems to be a fortune teller now, seller of the strange and exotic. Which one of these can I help you with today? Wait, don't speak. It wouldn't even let me speak. I come to find great fortune. Yes. You're searching for something. What though? A dead lover whose spirit you wish to contact on the other side? No, no. It, it's not that. It's not something you've lost, but something you're missing. 
yeah. cash money. Purpose. Some meaning in the chaos. This lie. Well, Interesting. you see that is something I can help you with. Come to work for me. I say I find things, but really, it is others who do the finding. I tell them and then she sells for, it. and they collect it for me from far and wide. Sometimes with ease, and sometimes through great hardship. It is work that can be as honest or dishonest, dishonest. as you want it to be. Hmm. How about it? Do you want to be one of my collectors? I make sure they are rewarded quite handsomely. A small fee is really the least I should ask for giving you what you're looking for and setting you up with everything you need to get started. There are more tools you may want from me in due course, but first, you will need to prove yourself. If you don't want to start now, you can find me again, and the offer will still be there. Purchase, don't pay. purchase. Purchase collector bag. Excellent. Okay, fine. Excellent. There's well, my 15 gold. I have something I think you'll find very interesting. <laughs> Here is a list of things that I Do all of the, the rolls cost 15 right gold? Finding them. It is amazing what you will discover now that you are paying attention. Rank 1. Alright. Collect to rank up F1 for details. Alright, give me all that information. Two. So we, uh, I guess these two points we can use to unlock stuff. Is that right? So we can unlock the field shovel. But then... Okay, so you unlock it, and then you unlock it for purchase. Got it, got it. You unlock that outfit. There's a big horse. Oh my. Lancaster repeater variant. Oh, really? D is there more stuff that you'll unlock eventually, I guess? I don't know which other one to unlock. Novice. Okay, here we are. You can see the rest of the stuff here. There's some outfits, some refined binoculars, collector camp theme, metal detector. Okay, so you have to be level five to unlock the metal detector. Got it, got it. Lantern. Oh, that's for the horse. That's pretty cool. <laughs> Steampunk glasses. Knotted bandana and the pioneer. Press E, there you go. Give it up, Major. Major Rorschach. Rorschach. How you doing? Established, damn. But that's hot. I like that. Uh, look to the distance. Oh, it's an emote. Another outfit. Another horse. And a satchel upgrade. Level 16. How high up do all these go? Okay, open the item wheel and holding tab and pressing R. Okay. And then collector's bag. Tab to use. Pin collection. So we're looking for flowers, tarot cards, uh, cup, uh, so suit of Cups, suit of swords, suit of wands, pentacles, uh, lost jewelry, lost jewelry, necklaces, rings, bottles, eggs, arrowheads, family heirlooms, and coins. Very good. 20? Okay. Nice. And the blue tokens you get for loving don't bother being stingy when, the, when you get plenty. Okay. So honestly, by the end, you'll have everything unlocked then, from what it sounds like, right? You've been given a collector's map and help you get started if you mass and uh, satchel and purchase others from her. I'm not going to buy any, because number one, I'm broke. Number two, uh, we have that guide. How do you stop your horse? To be, like, actually, though. I press S, but it just turns around. <laughs> Do you just stop moving? Am I dumb? Is it space? I 
I feel like I can't figure out some basic maneuvers. I hear tell of your good deeds, but you do not fool me. Uh, give me the shovel. It's R1 on PS4. Yeah, I don't know what it is on PC. Weapons, tools. Wait, there's a shovel. Not enough cash. Buy now with 14 gold. It doesn't even let me buy now. I will use gold. Is it worth it? 14 or 350 dollars. If you want to take this work seriously, I think I should. Yeah, it'll it'll pay for itself. Look out for mounds of disturbed earth and use a shovel to dig for items. All right, all right. Let's uh, so we are right. Where are we? Rhea. Okay, so technically there should be something in the settle center of a circle of rocks. Beware of cu cougars. Like right here, essentially. Uh, don't use the gold on the shovel, at least in my opinion. No, wait, you need it for more than I remembered. Okay. Yeah. Oh, well. I used it anyways. So. I know it will come in use. And I mean, oh, God. Oh, God. There's the cougars. Oh, no, 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 no. Get back here, horse. Get back. Chill. Chill. Oh, God. No, 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 no. Damn it. Yeah, they weren't kidding when they said look out for cougars. <laughs> and they spawned me all the way up here, too. To still be using the shovel when you get the metal detector, so it's all good. Just my luck there. You know, at least you don't lose money in this. Also, I think that actual thing is, like, right here. Is there like a, if I use eagle eye, will it help me spot the stuff I'm looking for? It says there should be one around here. So I want to be ready for this stupid thing. What are you looking for? A flower? Um, yeah, I'm actually not sure. And yes, it will. Okay. Um, it is a... Let me see. It's a chipped arrowhead. In the center of a half circle of rocks, beware of cougars. So a half circle of rocks. And it says it's just about right here. I don't see it. Half circle, maybe this is it? Oh god, there's a cougar. Where'd you go? Or was that a snake? That's definitely not a circle. I mean, I could watch the video. Cause it looks like there's an attached video for it. Half circle of rocks. Maybe this? Aha! Aha! Am I rich yet? All right, I'm down. Okay, so there's a flower right here. Yep, it's right about there.
are these weeklies like reset a day or um yeah video might be better or are these reset um are these dailies or weeklies there's videos you can use to get a full set of whatever collectible uh let me check horse cargo i'm gonna swap my weapon or no horse weapons there we go now we can swap room i'll use that take a carbine repeater that's good for now i don't have any sh uh what ammo for those all right good collectibles reset daily there's three different days or cycles it goes through. Okay. So, does that mean, like, that spot I was just at, if I go there tomorrow, is it possible that something else will be there? Or is it, like, completely random? Like, something will be or something won't be? I'm not going that far, so... I'll just run it myself. Is it worth doing all of the uh, the ones within a collection? Like, say, doing all the flowers or all of the arrowheads, things like that? Or are you better off doing, like, just whatever you can grab, whatever is closest to you? Should be coming up here. Right here. Hey, flower, where you at? I think that might be it right there. Yeah, that's definitely it. Would you look at that? Oh, that was easy. Uh, there's three different days or cycle collections sell for double. Okay, wow. So you're better off like grabbing one of the whole thing. There's another flower. Let's do this. Um, under bridge. The right here, underneath the bridge, there's a coin. I feel like it should be on the road as in the collection is 10 time or 10 items if you sold each individually before collecting the set you would get half of what you would do for completing the set if you come back to that one spot tomorrow it won't be there okay so that that map updates daily and for not only madame lazar's location but also what's actually there and then um all this gear and stuff changes. You can't get the coin, no metal detector. Oh, okay. Oh, that's why it had that icon. Got it, got it. Well, appreciate that. Yeah, I saw there's a little uh, thing next to it. Okay, so next we'll go for, looks like there's one right here I think right there uh, another flower and then right here can I actually Mac do multiple markers oh yo lit oh my gosh this is gonna save so much time all right so right here um, let me just check before I click on these there's a upstairs inside wardrobe right here could be some whiskey inside mine on a crate next to the lantern man right
I think that's going to be the mine entrance. And then it says it's like right here. Oh, whoops. Let's put it right there. Um, another one right here. I think that's a next to a couple of rocks and a small tree. Easy to spot. Earrings. Now, if it has a pickaxe on it, is that something specific? Or that's like whatever. There should be a flower right here. To the right of Tumbleweed, there should be something right here. Inside burn building on top of the fireplace. All right, and then I'll tag these last two. It's a card right there. And a never, another flower right here. There. Okay. About to get like all of the West Coast right now. Uh, so our closest one is probably this location. Right there. Never used that map, so I couldn't tell you what the pickaxe is about. Okay. No worries. I guess we'll find out. Um, for now, if you're interested in collecting set... Uh, okay. Once you get the metal detector, though, you can spend like an hour a day going through collecting that set. The coin it said is worth like $540. For now, if you're interested in collecting sets, you can see how much each set is worth in your collector satchel. Uh, just judge which ones to go for. I've never used it. Okay, and never used the map. Um, how? So you can see how much they'll go for in your satchel. And that was is that F one, or was that just like the guide? Progress, maybe. Rolls, no. Collector's bag. <clears throat> Collection value, 155. Okay, so it straight up tells you how much is worth what? 240. Oh, wait, you can toggle between them? Yeah, you can. Nice. So the cards are worth a good amount. Earrings, there's 11 of them. I mean, $200 isn't horrible. Flowers are worth the least amount. So cards get better. Earrings are good. Or uh, bracelet, earrings, necklace, rings, gin, goose egg, arrowhead, airbrush. Damn, them, po them pennies though. Okay, I see, I see. Nice. So that that helps I might actually cancel out some of these then or is, are they just worth doing just because you get the level for it I know obviously it'll get easier but there's that flower I'll actually pick up some of these because why not American wildflowers 